Best. Became a TV legend playing Jack Tripper on Three's Company. Now he's starring in the ABC show Eight Simple Rules for Dating My Teenage Daughter. Please welcome John Ritter. comes out cocky, you come out humble. I yeah, like well, it. no, I was trying to do a callback from, you know, I yes. couldn't top you. You know, following you, it's a little bit like Stevie Wonder and now Ludacris. What's up? <laughs> but uh, People it's love just Ludacris. A, it, Dana true. has, he's so fast that, you know, he throws away a lot of routines that other comedians would base their whole act on. He's just so quick. So I take the geez, ones he throws away. I've come out I'm, with a... I'm going to call my wife right now. Can I get a phone? Well, my <laughs> wife is coming over to meet you from the hotel because she didn't know you were on, so she's bringing my kid over to Damn. ask you to please do Turtle Turtle for her. Oh, really? Yeah, yeah. Oh, she loves sweet. you, Yeah, wow. as we all do. Dana Carvey! <laughs> John Ritter! No, no, sir. No, no, no me! Ah, ah, me! Oh, stop that. Put their phone. Yeah! Sorry. I, don't, I can't handle both of you doing that at the same time. <laughs> oh, it's sweeping the nation. No, sorry. Sorry. Everybody backstage is doing yeah, it. Yeah. It's Dana the Conan. Thing. It's, it's going to become a dance soon. Yeah. In clubs, people are going to be going, yeah. I'm still. John yes. Travolta told me impression, do an impression of someone. He says, you know, it's like the sincerest form of flattery. You know? <laughs> so you consider yourself flattered, Conan. Yeah. Thanks, buddy. Like we love Conan. you. <laughs> What you're talking about? I don't know. Now, uh, we have go. to talk about, there's a big controversy. There yeah. was a big controversy, and I want to get your take on this yes, whole sure. thing. Uh, uh, Three's Company now is being aired on Nick at Night. Yeah. And uh, apparently a certain episode created a stir because it's on I early. Know I know what you're going to say. Tell, tell the whole story. Well, tell my, what the controversy was. And Well, this is serious. I mean, this is serious. We had to put a stop to this because, you know, sometimes a, a press release can really damage some people and hurt right. some feelings. My, my secretary, Sue Wilcox, who, uh, I've, who's a very wonderful lady and very, you know, very mm -hmm. proper and adult, you know, taking care of childlike people like me, and mm -hmm. uh, she called me and she was very upset and she said, you know, I don't know quite how to say this, but there's a fan um, somewhere in Tacoma uh, who has a lot of time on his hands and he has a freeze frame and he called Nick at night upset because he said that he saw one of uh, Jack Tripper's testicles appear from, uh, this is true, uh, it's not, not funny. He didn't, he was, he, he was watching the show and there is a scene where you're in your boxer shorts. And apparently I, I jump over a couch. Jump and, over a couch and there's and, one, you know, and, and. That's what it felt like when I heard. Yeah, and uh, apparently one of, one of the twins escaped. One of the twins escaped. And, uh, one of the twins escaped the asylum. Not yeah. funny. Yeah, Not and funny. wait, and so Not and it's, it must just be for like a second, just or for a brief second. But you know, in those days, they didn't have pause buttons and freeze frames. And so video people tape. thought this will never be a problem. Well, no, I mean, um, my wife Amy, she said, I remember as a little kid, I caught a fleeting glimpse of something passing by very quickly that didn't make me laugh, but made me wonder. Right. But, right. Um, so anyway, they wanted a response from me, and Nick at night said, well, yes, we, very seriously, they said we saw one of Mr. Ritter's uh, testicles uh, appear from a blue box or shorts. I we saw it, we saw it appear. Yeah, like and a, people were talking about it like it's a UFO. <laughs> I've seen it. It was right over yonder, you that swamp. Yeah. And, uh, yeah. Kill it. <laughs> Come on, I'm not Rodney Dangerfield, all potatoes and no meat, you know what I mean? But anyway, so... Oh, um, my God. No, I was... I was <laughs> I just wanted to lock it in. Oh, but anyway, sorry. Man talk. But anyway, uh, so I had to do a response. Amy came up with it. I said, listen, I, you know, I know Nick at Night is cutting the offending mem the uh, scene. Yes. And, uh, yes. Yes. Which hurts me. They cut the scene? They cut the scene and they'll show, they'll show it in, uh, in an edited form because they didn't want to offend, uh, you know, uh, the guy in Tacoma. So I said, they said they need a response from you. I said, you're kidding. And, and I can't believe the press needs a response yeah, on yeah, this. Yeah, it was a slow news day. Yeah. And uh, there was no saber rattling going on if you know what I mean and so um well, thank you Dan and so uh what happened was uh I I said well let me have a minute I was thinking about Amy what should I say you know I know it's on Dick at Night Nick at Night and I, I went, it's not funny no it's not funny 
And so right. what it's Andy not right. said, what you just Andy, did right there was not no, right. Not funny. It's what not you funny just when did it happens was, to you. What you American. just did was wrong. Imagine Uncle Charlie. No, uh, what happened is uh, <laughs> he was the biggest star in the world. <laughs> Mickey. But anyway, um, what happened was I finally had to respond, you know, and, right. and, and basically I said, uh, well, I, li I asked Nick at night uh, to please air both versions, you know, one with the, the original and then one the editor, because sometimes you feel like a nut, sometimes you don't. <laughs> did they did actually go out? It went all over the country. In, in, in print, and I have some of them framed. I'm just so proud. <laughs> you're, and, actually, uh, you're actually sitting there and you're looking at yeah, this. Yeah, it's just amazing. You know, you think that your privacy is uh, just one step beyond surreal, and then it gets even crazier. Do you so, know how this happened in the first place? I mean, weren't, weren't there, uh, what, didn't, don't well, they? Well, no, in those days, in those days, you know, they had they to have, sew up the flies of yeah, the boxer yeah. shorts. And for me, thank you, they, they, you made me wear some... Um, uh, underpants under my boxer right. shorts because God knows I'm well, a yeah. wandering kind of guy. Well, right. for, for me, but they now, used to put a, what they call a hooter clamp on it. <laughs> when what? you need a scotch more control, a hooter clamp. <laughs> it's a thing that keeps your unit together. It's a hooter clamp. Just kidding. Go ahead. <laughs> Everybody's like, Hooter Clamp. Hooter Clamp. Hooter Clamp. <laughs> get me a Hooter Clamp. Hooter Clamp. Gotta get me one of those. I swear to God, in six months, you'll see an infomercial for, is your member dangling and jangling all around? You need the Hooter Clamp. Yeah. I'd pay as much as $49. Well, how about $29? i am a celebrity with a Hooter Clamp. Get me out of here. But doesn't it sound, a Hooter Clamp sounds like a thing. I would even eat there. I'm sorry. Good night. No, no, that's the wrong thing. I'm so sorry. That's see, weird. it's not funny. Anyway, I'm so it. glad I came on here and wasted your time. You didn't just story. waste our time, you offended America. I'm so proud. I'm so proud. You sick hey, of me, Hey, by John. the way, Eight Simple Rules, I just found out, got picked up for next year. Hey, congratulations. Fire the door, Katie! Eight Simple Rules for Dating My Teenage Daughter Thank airs you. Tuesday yeah. nights at 8 on ABC, and John's hosting the TV Land Awards on March 12th. With my hooter clamp. Yeah, with your hooter clamp. <laughs> Always a pleasure Thank having you, you here. He's a good man. John Ritter, everybody. We'll take a break. We'll come back. Ned Nugent's going to cook. Lawn care? Come into Ace Hardware. We'll help you with all your lawn and garden needs. Ace, the helpful place. Come on, we're gonna be late. Just grab yourself a Sammy Light. I'll be right out. Tasted new Sam Adams Light, the first great tasting light beer. Shockingly great taste. Thanks. <laughs> Summer internship in the music business. Zero dollars a year. Artist rep in 2010. Mucho dinero. CEO of record label in 2020. Money out the yin yang. The internship that got you in the door. Priceless. Apply for an internship working on a Jurassic 5 album. Go to MasterCard.com. Last call tonight. MSNBC Phil Donahue. If you're the grandfather of talk television, does that make you the proud father of Jerry Springer? He is one of my illegitimate children. Carson after Conan. We'll be the first to tell you there's nothing that remarkable about the back seat of an Nissan Altima until you realize how far away it is from the front seats.
the 2003 Nissan Altima with a $249 per month lease. See it at your Nissan dealer. I've been treating serious low back problems without surgery for years, and almost 8 out of 10 of my patients are pain-free. I recently shared my success treating disc-related back, hip, and leg pain with my colleagues. From now on, they're going to recommend Vaxd before surgery. The computer-controlled Vaxd table gently decompresses the spine, taking the pressure off the discs and nerves, allowing them to heal. Call day or night for free information and consultation. When it comes to these eyes, I'm not taking any chances. That's why I chose Carter Eye Center. They offer a money-back guarantee, and they are the first in Dallas to offer CK laserless treatment for hyperopia that may reduce or eliminate your need for reading glasses. A guarantee, CK, and LASIK starting at $4.99 per eye. Now that's something you can count on. To learn about our money-back guarantee, call us at 214-696-2020 or 800-950-2020 or visit CarterEyeCenter.com. No one has won more NASCAR Winston Cup Manufacturers Championships than Chevrolet. It's Thunder Days. Get 0% APR financing on Silverado, S10, and Avalanche. Or choose 3,000 total cash back on Silverado 1500 two-wheel drive and S10. Or 4,000 cash back on Avalanche. And you thought this kind of excitement only happened at the track. Chevy. Drive in Texas.